All right, we're going to go into worship. We're going to go into worship now because yes. there's the power. Yes. Isn't it wonderful to just yes. praise him through it all? Thank you, Lord. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Welcome, Jen and Cheryl and Marcy, Amanda, Marie, Chastity. Thank you, Lord, for Tom, Marion. Thank you, Lord, for Diane and Jay and yes. Jason. Yes, yes, Lord. Thank you for Kathy and Kevin and Nicole and Michael and Judy. Thank you, Lord. Yes, it's worship. We're going to do this song again. We're not going to stop now. I give you glory for all you brought me through. Oh, yes, Lord. And now I'm ready. To follow after you And now I'm ready For whatever you want to do Your presence Is an open door We want you, Lord Like never Cross before me, hope on things above, and in you, Jesus, the best is yet to come.
receive your blessing I hear the Lord saying over you it's time to receive your blessing make room for your blessing make room for your blessing make room for your blessing it's time to receive your blessing oh I'm a God of abundance I'm the God of abundance I'm the God Abundance. It's time to receive your blessing. It's time to receive your blessing. Oh, receive your blessing, says the Lord. Say this: I receive my blessing, Lord. I'm receiving my blessing, Lord. I receive my blessing. It's breakthrough in your inheritance. It's breakthrough in your generational line. Blessings and inheritance that have been set there. They are divine. And the Lord said that he has drawn a line in the sand for your generational line. Today, he says, you have authority to stand and release the inheritance that the enemy has held captive. We break off all agreements. We break off all alignments that we have made with any of the iniquitous sin that has given the enemy a right legally to hold it back. We break that now in the name of Jesus. Everyone that's watching, sever that tie. Sever agreements. Sever it now. And ask him to forgive you. Forgive us, God, for making agreements. 
for making any alignments with iniquitous sin in our line. We lose, we lose our inheritance in the name of Jesus. It's our legacy that we're leaving and building up and loosing for our seed. Holy, 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 holy. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. Ooh, there's a holy presence here. Father, we send this to every home in the name of Jesus. The loosing of blessings. To loose them and then to receive them. Father, we receive your blessings. We receive. This time where it looks like famine, it looks like destruction, things have shut down, but the Spirit of God has not shut down. The kingdom is not shut down. Blessings have not shut down. Inheritance is not shut down. We just break off fear right now, everyone watching. We break it off. We strip off fear and worry and stress. Rest. Shalom. Shalom. This next song is called Only King Forever. Who's the king forever? There's only one. It's Jesus. There's only one. Not this virus. Not the mainstream media. Not the president. Not Democrats, Republicans. Not your pocketbook. He is the only king forever. He's it. If you're looking for it somewhere else, you're gonna really regret. Because he's it. He's it. So this is time, as we sing this, to war with your feet. As you can tell, we're radicals for those that don't know us. We're not afraid to use everything we have to worship and to praise. So in this song, find something, find a a pot and pan and get a get a get a, a spoon and just start hitting it as a drum. Get creative. I believe when you come back to church, you're not even gonna look the same way. You're not gonna look like you did. We won't recognize you. Jesus name. Let's do it. Here we go. Silent ground, nations rise and fall. Kingdoms on strong now shaken. We trust forever in your name. The name of Jesus. We trust the name of Jesus. You are the only king forever. Almighty God, we lift you higher. You are the only King forever, forevermore. You are victorious. You are the only King forever. Almighty God, we lift you higher. You are the only. 
Some of you are going to have visions for the first time. As you look at perfect peace, shalom in the face, which is Yeshua, Jesus. gets erased by the glory that radiates from his face. Allow peace to rule and reign in your hearts in this season and beyond. Allow peace to rule and reign in your heart. of the end of this season you will come forth radiant in my peace and shalom and others will be attracted to the peace that you exude all they will see is him Rest, 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 rest. Come to me. Come to him. Come to me. All who are heavy laden and weary. Come to me.
all my burdens, God, all my fears, all the pain, all the worry, Lord God, I release it to you. And I receive. releases right now sovereign freedom wholeness not just healing but wholeness in your soul holy presence right there and right here it's holy ground it's holy it's holy ground where the presence of the Lord is there's peace there's joy perfect love casts out fear there's perfect love in his presence. Jesus. Jesus. Holy ground. Whoa.
where the lake was and where the sky was. And he said, heaven and earth are coming together and that line has grown dim. Heaven and earth are coming together. And especially in this time, when we look, we're not gonna be able to tell the difference. that Jesus has put on my heart is John 12, 31, 32. The time for judging this world has come. We're seeing things shaken. We're seeing things stirred up. Things are closing down. Doors are closing. When Satan, the ruler of this world, will be cast out. Oh. That means the things that Satan once had a hold of, no longer does he have hold of. Because God is doing a new thing and he's pouring out his spirit in a brand new way. The things that Satan once had hold of, no longer does he have hold of. Right here, he's saying, now the prince of this world will be driven out. I like that version better. Whoa. Oh, what God is doing, pouring out a spirit, Satan can't handle. And so he's being driven out because God is beginning to pour out a revival on the earth. He's beginning to pour out a revival on the earth. And Satan cannot stand in the midst of it. That's why things are being shaken. That's why things are being shaken right now to the core. Because of the things that he had once hold of. He says, God says he no longer has hold of it. He's being driven out. And then through that we see this. The next, very next chapter. And I, when I am lifted up from the earth... I will draw all people to myself. Oh, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He's drawn. Now that all this stuff, prophetically, what I am seeing and what Jesus is showing me, all these lockdowns, all these shutdowns, all the doors being closed, you can't have this many people. It's the sports, the, the idol of sports is being shaken. The idol of the marketplace is being shaken. Things are being shaken right now. It's because God is saying no more. The things that once held my people bound no longer are going to hold my people bound because I am pouring out my spirit in a brand new way. And the prince of this earth is being driven out. I just say right now, the prince of this earth is being driven out of the church. No longer is Satan going to have a place in the church anymore in Jesus' name. We declare that right now. That's why we're going to see begin to see ministers and ministries and churches shaken and even some closed into the ground because Satan is no longer in that place anymore. God is not going to allow Satan to begin to just take his people captive anymore. 
He's being driven out. And he's looking for a bride that's going to lift up the name of Jesus and all people will be drawn to him. In this place, Lord, may your name be lifted up so that all people will be drawn to you, Jesus. Lord, we believe that people are being drawn by your spirit, Lord. By your spirit, Lord. Oh, hallelujah. We praise your name, Lord. Shut up,
to hear, give us eyes to see, give us ears to is so thick here. Wow. The atmosphere has totally changed. Oh, 
Supernatural activity, activity, activity. <sighs> Miracles carried from heaven down to earth. Miracles. Blood transfusions. The blood of Jesus. Leukemia has to bow. Blood transfusions. Cancer has to bow. Cellular restructuring. Supernatural entering. see them dipping their bowls in the anointing that's in this room. And I see them dipping the bowls of his presence that's in this room. And they're going to your house and they're just dumping it on you. They're dumping it in your room. They're pouring it in your room. They're pouring it in your house. Because there is an overflow of abundance of God's presence in his glory in this place.
God, but the Lord has your number. You will pay back. In Jesus' name, amen. Praise God. Whoa. Jesus. Jesus. Hallelujah. Family, just keep worshiping. We're going into offering because that's worshiping. As you know, you should all be clapping right now and cheering because it's offering time because we're cheerful givers. 
Hallelujah. Pastor Brooke.